In this demo, we'll cover how to use raised events on masters, so each instance of a master can have different interactions. Raised events also enable widgets within masters to interact with widgets outside of a master. For example, setting a dynamic panel state on a page from a widget inside a master. Here's a master with three buttons for displaying product details, reviews, and other information. We're going to reuse this master on multiple product pages and display the relevant content for that product. Each button already has a case to set the button to its selected style on the click, but we also want to add an action to raise an event. First, we'll add the raise event action to the details button. From this view, you can add, remove, and organize raised events. We'll add and select the event on details click. Then we'll do the same for the reviews and other buttons and raise the events on reviews click and on other click. Let's add the master to our first product page for shoes. On this page, there's a dynamic panel called Product Info that contains states for the details, reviews, and other information. When we select the master, the On Details Click, On Reviews Click, and On Other Click events that we created are shown in the Interactions pane. Like other events, you can add cases to these events to perform actions. So let's add a case to the On Details Click to set the Product Info panel to the Details state. And we'll do the same for on reviews click and on other click. Then, on the product page for magazines, we can add the same master and use the raised events to set the panel states on this page. You can see in the prototype that clicking the three buttons shows the relevant content on the shoes and the magazines page. And that concludes the Raised Events demo. If you have any questions, email us at support at or tweet us at ActureRP.